Hey you guys, welcome to Hilltop RV. My name is Christopher Guestwicky and I am one of the sales consultants. I've been here for 18 years and today I would like to do a small walk around presentation on a 2017 Coachman 21 TQX hybrid travel trailer. Now a lot of people progressively start off with a pop-up. Their next step in the equation is to move to something like this. We call them hybrids because they have ends that pop out like a pop-up but they're all self-contained so you get the creature comforts you get the shower you get stoves refrigerators hot water real toilet things like that that make the experience just a little bit better so what i'm going to start off with is showing you how easy it is to set one of these up so you'll see they have the true lock system that lock in the bed and with the simple push of a finger you do the unlocking and you bring it down. These beds are held by a cable, one on each side. They have 1,100 pounds of support, so plenty sturdy. Hold your bug catchers over and your rain drips. So we have the start of the bed. I'm gonna run inside while Chris looks at this out here. And you can see, folks, within about 60 seconds, you literally have a bed out. So very easy to set up. Now, if you'll follow me this way, let's go here. The storage compartment. Storage is always a big deal because you like to bring along things, golf clubs, fishing rods, flotation devices, chairs for the campfire, all the stuff that you want to bring. This has a pass-through belly storage right through the front okay so plenty of outside storage in this small unit you'll notice this is an all fiberglass skinned unit okay so there's not a seam in this camper anywhere no seams no leaks behind the skin is a 100 percent welded aluminum frame strong and light now let me ask you, with your camper you have now, how many times has the wind kicked up or a storm kicked up? You had to run outside at two o'clock in the morning to put your awning away. Let me show you something. No, no longer do we have to run outside to put the awning away. You have a fully automatic awning with LED lights for nighttime to brighten things up. Come on this way with me, guys. You'll notice another bunk end. This actually has sleeping capacity for up to six. Huge, considering it's only 21 feet. You'll also notice another small storage area in the back. So not only do we have the storage in the front, we have the storage in the back. Now, if you get to a park that by chance offers cable TV, things of that nature, you do have cable TV hookup and satellite hookup. If a lot of people have satellite at home, so they like to bring their satellite receiver along with them. That way they have TV for the rainy day. You also have black tank flush, okay? So after you've gone through your weekend and the kids and everybody have used the potty, when you go to dump, you hook up a water hose and it cleans out your black tank. That way you don't have any odors, okay? Very good idea. You'll see the third bed out right here. Again, sleeping capacity for six. Now, when purchasing a camper like this, obviously there are kids involved. So after the kids come from the woods, they've been out fishing, they've been down at the beach, handy outside shower. Washes all the sand, all the dirt off before you go into the nice camper. Come on with me, guys. As you can see already, many features, many benefits to your camping lifestyle. Let's go inside.
As I pointed out when walking around, we have one bed, two beds, and then a third bed up there. Sleeping again for six very comfortably. Now, some of the creature comforts that I spoke about. Bathroom, very important. So you have a full stand-up corner shower. And sometimes people think smaller unit, smaller shower. I am 6'2", and as you can see, I can stand up in the shower. So I have room to take a shower, very nice. Full pantry for all of your canned goods, your cereal, bread, things of that nature. The things that you take along with you, okay? I have a little control panel here. This monitors my holding tanks, my LP, my battery life, and you also have your hot water heater ignitions here. This coach offers a six gallon hot water heater with a 14.8 gallon recovery rate per hour, almost 15 gallons, huge. And it is both gas and electric at the push of a button, either or. Okay, so all you do is push a button, away you go. Residential refrigerator and freezer, and it is two-way. So it is both gas and electric with plenty of room. Coming into the kitchen area, I have an 18-inch oven and then a three-burner stove. High output on the front with two standard burners on the back. So if you need to boil some water or something, you use the front burner. And these are direct strike ignition as well. So everything, the ease of use, very good. Everything is at the push of a button. You have your microwave up top. And then you have a 60-40 split residential style sink. Full booth dinette. If it's a rainy day or it's late at night, you want to play the games, the kids want to sit down, do a coloring book or something, it's all right here. You'll notice I have a full entertainment center. So this is AM, FM, DVD, CD. It also has USB ports, so you can hook up something like an iPod or something like that for music and things. And then you also have the TV, which is a flat screen LED mounted to the wall with a complete turning radius so it can be viewed from any one of the beds. This unit comes with a furnace and a roof mount air conditioning so whether it's hot out or cold out I can adjust the temperature to make it very comfortable in here. Wrapping this up we'll go to the bed ends. Now remember I pointed out these are held by cable, one on each side with 1,100 pound capacities. And the mattresses, gone are the day of the old foam mattresses. These are now teddy bears, super soft, super comfortable to lay on. Folks, I hope you've enjoyed this and I look forward to offering any service that I can in the future. Again, Christopher with Hilltop RV. Thank you very much.